Hey guys. In this tutorial we will learn about the perspective drawing of a hexagonal based prism. In this case, the hexagonal based prism of side 25 mm lies with its base on the ground and nearest vertical edge lying 15 mm above the picture plane. Initially, draw a horizontal line representing picture plane. Now, Draw another horizontal line at an offset of 45 mm below the picture plane to represent horizon. Also, draw another horizontal line at an offset of 70 mm below the horizon to represent ground plane. Then, draw another horizontal line 15 mm above the picture plane and draw the top view of an object with a vertical edge on that plane as shown below. Now, name the vertices of the hexagon from 1 to 6 as shown below. Since it is given that the stationary point lies in the central plane, 15 mm left to the center of the hexagon. So, project the point 1 vertically downwards as shown below to intersect the horizon. Now, Mark a point 15 mm left to the intersection point to obtain the required stationary point. To obtain the vanishing points, simply draw lines from the stationary point, parallel to the line 12 and line 16 to obtain the intersection point with the picture plane. Then, project the thus obtained intersection point vertically downwards to intersect the horizontal plane. This intersection points represents the two vanishing points. Now, simply join the stationary points with the vertices 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6 to obtain the intersection points A, B, C, D, E and F with the picture plane. Now, extend the line 1 2 up to the picture plane and mark that point as G. Then, project the point G vertically downwards to intersect ground plane. This intersection point represents the point G on the ground plane. Since the points 1 and 2 lies in the line vanished from G. So vanish the lines from point G as shown below, simply by joining point 5 with the vanishing points. Now project the points A and B vertically downwards to intersect this vanished line to obtain the points 1 and 2 on the ground plane. Then, since the point 6 lies in the line vanished from 1. So vanish the line from point 1 as shown below. Now project the point F vertically downwards to intersect this vanished line to obtain the point 6 on the ground plane. Let the points on the top face of the prism be represented as 1 prime, 2 prime, 3 prime, 4 prime, 5 prime, and 6 prime. Now, mark the point G on the top face of the prism, simply by drawing vertical line of 50 mm from point G as shown below. Then, vanish the point G prime as shown below. And the intersection of the vanished line with the vertical line from A and B represents points 1 prime and 2 prime. Again, vanish the line from point 1 prime as shown below. 
and the intersection of the vanished line with the vertical line from F represents the point 6 prime. Since the point 3 prime lies in the line vanished from 6 prime. So vanish the line from point 6 prime as shown below. Now project the point C vertically downwards to intersect this vanished line to obtain the point 3 prime on the ground plane. Also, since the point 4 prime lies in the line vanished from 3 prime. So vanish the line from point 3 prime as shown below. Now project the point D vertically downwards to intersect this vanished line to obtain the point 4 prime on the ground plane. Also, since the point 5 prime lies in the line vanished from 2 prime. So vanish the line from point 2 prime as shown below. Now project the point E vertically downwards to intersect this vanished line to obtain the point 5 prime on the ground plane. Finally, all the required vertices are obtained. Simply join all the vertices to obtain the required perspective drawing.